it's Lisa and welcome back to a new video. Today I am going to be doing a plan with me in my B6 Rings planner. I am using inserts from a light planner action and I am going to be planning for the week which was March 18th through March 24th. I am going to be using this kit right here from Two Little Bees. It is called Wise. It is a Harry Potter, well no not Harry Potter, it is a Ravenclaw kit and I am using this kit because if you are a Harry Potter fan and you keep up with all that's going on with Harry Potter, then you know that this week was a Ravenclaw week. So I am going to be using this kit right here. Here are the full boxes. This is a mini kit, you guys. This was a mini kit Monday, I do believe, or something like that. I'm not really sure. But it is a mini kit. And if you guys are interested in seeing my plans for the week, then stay tuned. And let's get to planning. All right, you guys. As you can tell, these are new inserts or you might not. I'm not sure if you guys keep up with all of that. But these are new inserts, you guys. And I purchased these right here because I do not need the four-page inserts or four-page, uh, well, they're all inserts, but I don't need that. And I don't know why in the world I even purchased those uh, inserts in the first place. I knew I didn't need those. And, um, uh, I feel like I just wasted inserts. I did use them, but I don't really need all of that space for how I plan in these inserts. So I wanted to try these little uh, smaller ones out. And I have been loving them. This is my fourth week in these inserts, and I do love them. At first, I thought I was not going to because I didn't think I had enough space, <laughs> but I do love them and I have found a way to make them work for me. So, uh, one thing I like about these inserts, you guys, is that I am still able to put in my washi and I like to put it down here on this side over here. And, um, I just need to cut off this one little piece right here. So let me get my ruler there. Uh, and I do use the shorter piece of a washi, but you can use whatever piece of washi you like. So, yeah. Y'all know I cannot cut anything straight. I don't know why this girl has problems cutting things and whatnot but it is what it is <laughs> and then because on the longer it's a uh, longer part of this washi there is some decorations on both sides so what I am going to do now is take a piece of this deco because there is quite a bit of it and I think I'm going to take this nine and three quarters right here to just cover up that little mistake I made right there. There we go. And then I can take this bow washi. I was going to use some Simply Yielded bow washi, but you guys know I like to use my items that came with the kits so as not to be wasteful. <laughs> <laughs> but I know some people like to add different things and I like to add different things every now and then but if I if I can use most of my kit then I want to use most of my kit because I paid for it right I am looking for my other little slice to here we go because that little apparatus is not working out for me, y'all. 
Now, the other thing I like about these inserts, you guys, is that I am still able to put in my weekend banner. And I like to put it in on this side over here. So, let me zoom you guys in a little bit. There we go. That's better, right? So, I am going to place down my weekend banner, you guys. And then... Uh, I am not going to be using date covers in these inserts today because I could not find date covers to match this kit. The blue was extremely hard to match and so was the light pink. So we are going to do without date covers. But I did bring in these uh, foiled silver date dots from Cricut Paper Co. They are quite large and I thought they would, you know, work since I am not going to be using date covers. So you guys, I am going to go ahead and put down my weekend banner. And for my weekend banner this week, y'all, I am going to be using these flags that came with the kit. Uh, I might bring in one piece of washi. I am not sure. We're gonna see how this is going to turn out. But yeah, guys, I am going to do that real quick, and I will be back in about two minutes and two seconds. <laughs> Okay, now that we have all of the bits and baubles down, we can get started by putting down our four boxes. And I think I'm going to start with this nine and three quarters. And I am going to place that one in the middle. And I have been placing my four boxes across the middle, but this week I am going to do something different. And I'll start by placing this one down here at the bottom of the column that went down a little crooked I was trying to straighten it up y'all <laughs> we just gonna let it go and then let's take the two blue ones and place those next to our nine and three quarters I do notice about these inserts is that they are slightly wider than the planner stickers the columns are just just a tad bit wider so you have to be aware of that when you order these inserts or if you ever purchase these inserts you guys and then we are going to take our last two boxes and I am going to take the girl and it's gonna place her down here at the bottom and let's take the eagle I'm gonna take the bird the raven claw and place it down over here at the bottom and I'm not going to place a box on Saturday and Sunday because I don't need to uh, put a full box over there uh, because you know I want to just place in the things that I have done on the weekend 
okay. Now we can start with Monday. I'm just going to go ahead and place my pages together so I won't, you know, have to be worrying about that. So I can zoom you guys in a little bit more. Okay, starting with Monday, it was my sister's birthday, and that is the first thing I want to mark. So I'm just going to take this half box right here with a bow, and that way I don't have to put in a bow, <laughs> even though I like my little foil bows, but we can start with that bow, and then I'm going to take this little present right here. Uh, this is a sticker from Rose Colored Days. It's one of her samples, and I think this is a uh, holographic uh, foil, but this is the only silver-ish <laughs> color uh, box happy birthday sticker I could find. So I was like, oh well, I can go ahead and use it today and mark my sister's birthday. There we go. Now, the next thing I want to mark on Monday is, oh my goodness y'all, I don't have my notes. That's so crazy. How am I supposed to do a plan with me without my notes? <laughs> I do remember my sister's birthday. Be right back y'all all right y'all back in a flash you guys never knew I was gone right <laughs> now the next thing I want to work on Monday is that I did go into Trader Joe's I like to go in Trader Joe's y'all and pick up some of their fresh flowers they are reasonable priced and I love to go in there I love their salads and they have this really good uh, popcorn that I like to get out of there and yeah. So I stopped in Trader Joe's and I am just taking that little grocery sticker from Once More With Love to Mark going into Trader Joe's. Somebody needs to make some Trader Joe's stickers, right you guys? And then the last thing I want to mark on Monday is that I did make a return to Nordstrom's on this Monday and I do want to mark that as well so I am going to be taking one of these half boxes and I'm going to be marking out this top to do right here can you guys see that or are you out of frame I think you guys are out of frame there we go. But there is a to-do there and I'm going to mark that out. And then I am just going to place my box right here. We're going into Nordstrom's for that return. And then the sticker I am going to use is from Tassel Planners. And I couldn't remember if I I decided to use that pink but I think I will use that pink since my box is blue and we're just gonna place it over here to mark going into Nordstrom's and that is all we are going to be marking for Monday we are now going to move on to Tuesday now the first thing I want to mark on Tuesday is that I filmed a video and let's go ahead and use one of these quarter boxes for filming and i did film three times this week you all so i do want to go ahead and place those down while i have my cameras out so let's do that real quick and the cameras i'm going to be using are from lovely plantery uh i just want to go ahead and use these up and i'm gonna take this one and i'm just going to place it here 
and then I filmed again on was it Thursday no it wasn't Thursday it was Friday so let's take a, another corner box let's take this blue one and again we are going to mark filming the same way we did on Tuesday and let's take this one right here it's sort of left but I think it matches the little uh, thing but I'm going to be covering those little colors up so it really doesn't matter <laughs> and then I filmed also on Sunday so let's take our last quarter box and place it here y'all I feel like I haven't filmed in a while and I probably am seeing that a lot lately <laughs> Uh, but I know I just filmed a plant with me not too long ago, right? But this is going to go up late. And usually if I do a uh, plant with me, I don't like to put them up late. But I had all of my things out for this plant with me. And I have just been lazy, y'all, because I have been doing so many other things uh, this week. And I just never got around to filming. So today is Sunday in the afternoon, and I decided to go ahead and film. Okay, sorry about that, you guys. I thought I had my little uh, silver hearts out because I knew I was going to be putting hearts in these cameras. And I didn't. But that should be the last uh, little interruption here. So let's just go ahead and place a heart here. If it stays on the camera. <laughs> and let's place one over here. And then we'll place one on Sunday as well. There we go. Now to judge up these boxes a little more with some foil, I did bring out my uh, little film edit stickers here. And I'm going to use edit because I did edit these videos as well. So let's just place these down real quick and we can get these stickers out of the way and there we go okay back to Tuesday I want to mark that I needed to go into Home Depot to uh, get some what did I need to, what did I need to get I think I needed to get some more paint or something out of Home Depot on Tuesday so I'm just taking one of these labels and we're just gonna place it there and I'm hoping that one of my little cars will cover up that little flag right there but if not I'm not going to worry about it and this blue is not going to match perfectly. So I'm just going to take the darkest blue shade that we have to mark that. And there we go. That'll work. Now the last thing I want to mark on Tuesday is that This Is Us was on, y'all. Y'all know I love my This Is Us. It's coming to an end this week. So I cannot wait to see that season finale. And speaking of season finales, y'all. My Mr. What? I'm going to do something different because I don't like that box to be right next to that box. My Mr. Was talking about 
cutting off the cable, you guys. And I was like, oh no. Don't you even think about cutting that cable off until <laughs> I watched the final season of Game of Thrones. I said, if you cut that cable off, we are going to have a problem. <laughs> because I was like, no way you don't cut that cable off right now and Game of Thrones is coming on in, <laughs> in a few weeks. Mm -mm. How many of you guys watch Game of Thrones? I love it. Uh, and how I got into watching Game of Thrones, you guys, is through YouTube. I watched this family on YouTube and they kept talking about Game of Thrones. I didn't know what it was, but they kept talking about it and they kept talking about it. And they had uh, particular episodes on their channels where uh, they had like they had this one uh, episode where they were talking about the Red Wedding. And I kept saying, what is the Red Wedding? What is that? What are they talking about? And I kept, you know, in my head I'm thinking about a wedding. And, you know, like I said, I had no idea what Game of Thrones was. I was thinking that it had something to do with some video games. <laughs> And so I was like, okay, you know, I'll give it a try. So I started watching it. And even when I started watching it, y'all, I was like, I don't see what they're talking I don't see why the name of the show is called The Game of Thrones. <laughs> y'all. <laughs> y'all. It took me, it took me a long time to realize that they were, the why the name of the show was Game of Thrones and that's because everybody was fighting for the throne. I'm like, oh my God, I feel like such an idiot. <laughs> but anyhow, uh, we are going to move on to Wednesday. Now on Wednesday, I want to mark that I had a bill do. And to mark that bill do, I'm going to take one of these boxes. Here, I did bring in some boxes because I knew I was going to run out of half boxes. I mean, not half boxes, quarter boxes. So I could use this light pink shade right here. Or I could use a gray shade as well, but the gray doesn't match perfect. So let's just go with the pink. When in doubt. Pink is always a thing, right? So let's uh, place a little school wiggle wiggle up there first. There we go. And then let's place our box. I'm going to make my own uh, Bill Do sticker because she doesn't have a Bill Do sticker in here. So what I decided to do for the bill do is take this dollar sign and where's my other sheet? There we go. This I was gonna take this uh, dollar sign right here that she provided, and then I was going to label. I mean, not label. Oh my gosh! I was going to double up on my stickers and then just put that little envelope there for what Bill do. And that is how I was going to walk Bill do. <laughs> that might look ghetto and janky y'all but hey it'll work. Now moving on I want to mark down that I did get some happy mail from Ribbon and Neil. Uh, but before I, I mark that, I want to mark that I did a target run as well. So let's mark our target run. And we're going to use these stickers right here from Magic Prints Co. And I'm just going to place that right there. Yeah, I have been I have been going to Target a lot lately because 
I was trying to find some of those tulips that they have or that they came out for uh, Easter and they got them in my store finally and the girls the girl that puts out the stuff in the morning for the bullseye section she said that she put them out she went to the back and when she got back y'all the lady took all of them i said are you serious she said yeah she took all of them i said oh my gosh these tulips are just like right on i, I think y'all they are just going so fast i can't even get them but lucky for me one of my done friends is which so sweet she went into target and she found a bunch of pink ones for me and she got them all for me and i was like thank you so much <laughs> you didn't have to do that but she got them all for me y'all all of the pink ones she was looking for the peachy ones and i had a bunch of the peachy ones so I gave her all of my peachy ones and she gave me all of the pink ones. Now, we are going to move on to Thursday, y'all. I always say that these plan with me should be like faster because, you know, there are smaller inserts and things like that. But y'all know me, I'm a hot mess express <laughs> and things never go as planned when it comes to me. So, okay. <laughs> All right, so on Thursday, I want to mark that I got in my package from Amazon. Y'all, y'all are never going to guess what happened to me. When I moved into this room, y'all, my light broke. So, I'm just using the lamp that I had on my desk. But the other day, not the other day, one day, doing this week or the week before my other light broke so I had to order a new light y'all I was like what else is gonna happen <laughs> what, what else is gonna happen <laughs> so it came in on that Thursday and I am going to mark that and I'm just gonna cover up the flag since it's already blue there we go yeah, I was like, oh my gosh, y'all, it never ends. Something is always happening to me lately. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> but that's okay, y'all. I'm going to survive and I'm going to get through it. <laughs> so the next thing I want to mark is that I prepped for my nook area. I wanted to paint it. And I started placing down my... Um, painter's tape to get it all painted and I must say y'all I love it so much I thought the color was going to be the exact same color that I was going to use but I ended up using the same color that I painted my kitchen and it's actually a different color so but I love it I love how it turned out and yeah that what that is what happened on Thursday. Now the last thing I want to mark on Thursday is that I read a few chapters of this new book that I got from the library and I am going to take oh you know what let's take this book I mean not this book this one right here I was gonna put in my little uh, fox and cactus girl but this half box already has books in it and the glasses and that is how I do. <laughs> I take my contact lenses out and I put my glasses on and I read. So that is perfect. Alright, we can now move on to Friday. On Friday, y'all, it was payday, yeah. It was payday, yeah. So I am going to mark payday. 
And how are we gonna walk, Patty? Let's go flag right here. I'm gonna take one of these flags. And I think I'll take my little sticker is blue. So let's take this one. And let's place it down this way. This little sticker is cute right here too. It has a little envelope to mark Happy Mail. But I'm just going to take my payday sticker and place it going across like that to mark that it was payday, yeah. It was payday, yeah. All right, y'all, moving on. The last thing I want to mark on this particular Friday is that I stopped and got my car washed y'all and then it rained the next day how about that <laughs> I said I, I couldn't believe it I was like I just washed my car yesterday and already it has rained on my parade so we're just gonna walk getting the car washed and then let's, I don't want to place a piece of uh, washi there, but I'm going to see, because I, I, I don't think a squiggle will look right there because of the little polka dots there, and I'm not going to, um, I don't want to wipe that out, you guys, so let's see if we can place a piece of washi there. Okay, moving on to Saturday. Saturday, we had breakfast, of course. You guys know that my mister is at home on Saturday mornings now, so I'm like, <laughs> y'all, he has been coming home. He, com he comes home now on Tuesdays. He comes home on Thursdays. He's home Friday nights. But by the time he get home on Friday nights, I'm asleep. So I see him on Saturday mornings. So But yeah, I'm like when he said his schedule was gonna change, he really meant his schedule was gonna change, y'all. <laughs> and I'm like, oh you know. Uh, why are you at home now? <laughs> I'm looking for my schoolers, y'all. They done blew away somewhere. Because now that he's home, y'all, he takes up much of my time. And I'm like, ay, 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 ay. Okay, so I cannot find my squiggles. They have flew away somewhere, y'all. So what I am going to do is put down some of this deco to divide up the space, which I think is cute. There we go. Cool. And then we can move on. I am going to mark that I had to go into Bath and Body Works. They had candles on sale. And I had an extra 20% off coupon. So I wanted to pick up some candles, y'all. So I'm just taking that sticker right there from the Coffee Monsters Co. to mark down. Going to Bath and Body Works. Now the last thing I want to mark is that I did paint the rest of the day. And that pretty much took up all of my Saturday. So I am going to take another one of these paint and boxes here to mark painting. And then I'm going to take a sticker from Rose Color Days. Now these are not paint stickers, but I took that clean uh, that cleaning bottle to mark a uh, preparing for the nook area because you know you have to clean and everything and then I said I was going to take this little broom right here because it sort of looks like a paintbrush if you turn it this away it can be 
a paintbrush. So that is what I'm going to use for a uh, marking that I painted the rest of the day. Now, moving on to Sunday, I want to mark that I needed to go back to the grocery store. I have already marked filming for that day. So let's mark getting some groceries. And I'm not going to put anything in that box because it has all of the deco there. So I'll just write in getting some groceries. And then the last thing I want to mark is that we all had dinner afterwards. Mr. cooked some barbecue or grilled some barbecue. So I want to mark in that we all had dinner together. So let's see. I thought I, thought I had one more little quarter box in the kit, but I don't. So I am going to take, I don't want to take another pink one. So let's just take this light gray one right here. And we're going to mark that down now I know these right here if you guys can't tell these are like a bluish type of foil but I figured since the kit was blue uh, I'm gonna take these little knife and uh, fork sticker right here to mark down having dinner but I feel like it could go since the kit was uh, mainly blues and I'm just gonna make it work y'all y'all know that stuff really doesn't <laughs> matter to me sometimes. So let's turn this back over. I am going to fill it in real quick and I will place it back in the inserts and we can put it into this video. All right, y'all, here is a final look at the spread. I think this turned out really, really cute. And even though this was the first week of spring and I did not use a spring kit, I think this kit was very light and springy enough even though it was a Ravenclaw kit <laughs> y'all know my favorite colors are blue and pink so hey I will use the kit like this anytime of the year it doesn't necessarily have to be a particular uh, reason but anyhow I hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you all so much for coming and planning with me today and as always I hope you are having a great day day and or a great week whenever you are viewing this video right here and I will talk to you guys in the next one bye y'all